I'm still trying to pin down exactly how it's happening. I think that I've just uh, dug into some instincts with how I work with it, and um, I don't consider a lot of the outside influences. I just go to my studio and try to make the work, and whatever comes in, I just try to uh, endorse and <laughs> expand upon, and I feel rewarded by all of it. Well, I'm always uh, pulled to paint someone when something's kind of going on with them and it's something I want to work through. And everyone's uh, in my inner circle of friends, so I know them pretty intimately and closely. So it's usually about wanting to just hone in on that person and think about them and analyze them and work on them in some way. I like working large. There's also some intimacy with the smaller pieces. So it depends on how much of the person I really feel like exposing at the moment. And whenever there's a dual portrait, it usually becomes a larger scale portrait to catch that connection. <laughs> September's been an amazing month. I have four exhibitions actually in the next two weeks. So I have a solo show in Denver um, at Plus Gallery, which I've been showing with for over a decade now. So it's kind of like a homecoming. So NPR is kind of endorsing this person that kind of grew up there and has spread their wings and is coming from another community. I see myself becoming a little more, um, even more abstract and kind of changing the figure a little bit and abstracting the shapes even more within it. And it's become a little more conceptual in terms of who I'm asking to pose for me. So that's all I can know right now. <laughs>